first step is to take the car's colour code reference, which, depending on the make and model, can be found in different parts of the car, such as the trunk, door pillars or under the hood. The location of this code may vary for each make and model. This information will be taken into consideration when starting to work with the colour management software. Once you have correctly prepared and cleaned the surface to be measured, it is time to make the colour reading with the spectro. First, in the main spectro screen, click on word lists and then add new work. This way the device will go into reading mode. Then place the spectro in the polished area. It must be rested evenly on the surface. If the device is properly placed, it will show green lights. Otherwise, these will be red. Then, perform five manual measurements without moving the spectro from the support surface. Sometimes the dark mode may get activated when measuring dark colours. This is to extend the reading time and luminosity when making the reading, as light reflection is more complicated with dark colours. After taking the five measurements, the results of the reading will be shown through the valuation indicator. Our recommendation is that if the five dots in green are not completed, there is a large difference between the five readings, and so we should carry out the measurement process again. The reasons for this incorrect result can be related to poor surface preparation, poor calibration, poor condition of the device's lens, or movements during the measurement process. Later, once the measurement is finished, save the reading information by clicking on the pencil icon. The information that we can save will be colour code, registration plate, vehicle manufacturer and vehicle model. It is interesting to save the information for each car and repair, which works as a repository of information that can be accessed in the future if needed. Then save the information and connect the spectro to the computer through the cable. You are now ready to work on the computer and to check the acquired information with the colour management software. 